Hey, what's going on, guys? Ema Apples here. Today, I'm be showing you how to get Siri on any of your devices that is running iOS 5 that isn't an iPhone 4S. So basically, this is something that's been long awaited, and um, CHPone finally released one. So as you can see here, there it is. And in order to download this, you're going to open up Cydia. Basically, once City is opened up, just go into the search. You don't have to add any sources because this package is in the Big Boss repo. And you're going to want to type in Spire. <coughs> S-P-I-R-E. And boom, there it is. It'll pop up there. You just want to click on that. You can install it. And I do recommend being on Wi-Fi, not on 3G, because this is a 100 megabyte package. So it will take a while to download over 3G. So basically, once you've got that installed, you're just going to head over into your settings. And first, you can scroll into General, Siri, and you're going to turn that on. And you can set out your information here. And then, once you've got that on, you're going to scroll down and you'll see Spire. And this is basically where things get a little bit confusing because you're going to need a proxy host for this to work. So basically what that means is basically if you don't have a 4S and you can't set up your own proxy server, someone else will have to do it with their 4S key, which will give others access to the actual Siri, which would be connecting to Apple servers. So basically, as you can see, I've got this one tucked in here. It's just a public one. I haven't had it work yet. I was just messing around with it once I first had it installed. So as you can see here, when I do turn it on, it usually just makes a little noise and it won't let me say anything. Yeah, see, it just stops right there. But basically, this is kind of like a mess around thing as of now before uh, a lot more proxies get released. But yeah, that is how to get Siri on your iOS 5 device. Thanks for watching, guys.